Greetings to you humans, I am Shadow and this is the day the sky turned grey. All I know about this game is that it's apparently overall very positive and France is in it. I am awful at French accents. I'm sorry. I, I try. I try my best. And I'm gonna try my best. And all that jazz. So yes. Let's, you know, let's let's just go. I'm very tired and may say something I'll regret, but let's go. All right, okay, different controls because XP. Click on Alt and N to make the game full screen. I'm not gonna do that. Why is it shaking? <laughs> Someone tell me why it's shaking. That makes it hard to read. Why do you do this? It's something you should probably look into. You know, in about eh. Why am I suddenly going German? Right off the back and I'm bat and I'm going German. We can see how well this is going to turn out, don't we? Ha <laughs> ha You know, in a world without love, there is no meaning. Out of no purpose. Different controls. Everything might as well be a sore sucking void. I wouldn't be anything. I don't have a purpose anymore. And that's kind of cut off. Uh, what do I say? I don't want to be mean to him. Because you can find purpose without love. <clears throat> you always have a purpose. Let's go with that. No, you always have a purpose. Uh, you're funny, you know that, we? Trying to make me feel better is a futile attempt. You're very depressed right now, Franz. Stop. <laughs> Everything changed the day the sky turned grey, you know? When it did, I felt as if something important had left me. I felt as if every bit of love in the world, regardless of the kind, was killed. It's a very grim way to put it. It died inside me, and everyone. Platonic, romantic, self-love, interests. Familial, you could also say. <laughs> None of those matter. Therefore, I no longer have a purpose here. No, I'm gonna be stubborn. No, your only purpose isn't to be the country of love or to do whatever you do. It's to be in the world, to be you. You really think that? You honestly think that without love, the country of love still has meaning? Yes. Messy. Because you don't need color to have love. Because things in grayscale still look pretty cool. Though it would be nice to see in color. I don't even know. I think... I think I know where you're coming from now. Spreading love, especially in a loveless world, that's important. Thank you for helping me see that. But all of the others are suffering just as I was. Oh, je m'excuse. Je... French. Oh! Please, please excuse my French if it is wrong. Which it most likely will be because I haven't... Oh. <laughs> oh. Je m'excuse. Je m'excuse? I'm gonna check after this and there'll be a little note saying if it is or not. If I've butchered it or not. Not, not purposefully. I don't know. That is purely just a guess. You probably don't know what's going on. I don't know what happened exactly. But the sky, everything, me, you, everyone, we all lost a color. Who is me? Who is you? What? Who is this person? I don't even know. Is this just like an OC or something? Is it just supposed to be me? 
Is it just kind of fourth wall poking at? Am I the celestial? Then again, I always was. Heck. <laughs> the world, it's a pencil sketch on a discarded canvas that hasn't been, hasn't seen the love of a paintbrush in years. Whatever toxic color also released everyone's deepest issue with themselves. For me, it was this. I don't normally let people see that side of me. I don't really know a world without love. And without being the country of love. I thought that nobody would care anymore. I worry that people only love me for my title. You have at least basic you have at least basic idea of what I mean, no? At least our basic idea. I'm sorry, I'm going to uh, I point out everyone's grammatical mistakes and I feel like a like an ass for doing it. But it's like <sighs> you know, some people want to hear it. But now we have to fix this. Thank you once again for helping me see. But now I need to go help the others. Press X Z again. Your objective spread positivity, but there's a catch. What's the catch? You gonna tell me? Well, you expect me to know? Just don't mess up and you'll be fine. Also, save often. You bitch! <laughs> You can at least tell me what the threat is here. Otherwise, I'll just... <laughs> running, like, doing all sorts of shit. Come back here when the color is back. All right. You're of support of Big Brother. Okay. You... The directionless. What? The self-loathing. The forgotten. And... The insecure. Oh boy, this is just full of joy and happiness and friends. Uh, let's, let's just go clockwise, so. Oh dear. This was the directionless. Canada. Over at the word, Canada is scratched out. Even though Canada isn't even a word. Sud Italia, South Italy. And the entire thing has been scratched out. But you can just make out the words Kongrich. Kongrich Prussian. Kongrich. Prussian. So that would be Prussia. Obviously. Well, not obviously, but. Is <laughs> Prussia. So, uh, let's go Canada first. Canada! Where you at, Mr. Canada? Oh no. Oh boyo. Boyo, let me tap your head. Uh, Matthew, what's wrong? I'm not gonna be mean to him. I'm gonna ask. No. There's definitely something wrong, so I'm gonna tell him to tell me. Matthew, tell me right now. Matthew, you know what? Never mind. Huh? Well, okay then. You could see that something's wrong. Just go all aggressive mother on him. Uh, it's just like, you will tell me right now, boyo. Boyo. Stop that! Can I- can I run? I can't- I can't seem to run. Alright, Canada, why you crying, boy? Let's see what's wrong. What? Oh. I skipped the text thing. Whoop de freaking do. <laughs> this is gonna take longer than I thought, especially since I can't run. He run in an alternate universe where I actually can. <laughs> he zoom. 
Nothing went wrong. I'm gonna ask if he's okay. Are you alright? If you want, I can come back late. Please, stay. Of course. Do you want to talk about it? We. Oui. I just feel underappreciated. Nobody really cares much about me, regardless of what I do. All my accomplishments are ignored. You're one of the only people who can tell me apart from my from Alfred without needing to look closely. Just tell me, am I really invisible? Uh The funny thing is he doesn't actually look that much like America. Well, at least not to me. Are you really invisible? <sighs> no. You're definitely not. You're a damn big country. <laughs> no, you're not invisible. So they just hate me for me. I see. I didn't mean- Fine, uh, I knew this was gonna happen. They hate me because I look like Alfred then. But- Francis- I understand you didn't mean that, but if I'm not invisible, then why do people ignore me so much? I prefer to just be forgotten completely. In that case, people are not even getting to know me. This text scroll's also pretty slow. You might want to look into that. Or you know, you could- I know I want to talk, but- <laughs> Just, you know, make sure that people know that you're not Alfred. Tell them how you're different. Tell them to look for the curl and they'll do it. <laughs> but he's not invisible. No, it did the wrong thing. Shit, no. Ah. God damn it. I could move on to s try and do someone else, but I am a stubborn ass. <laughs> I'm swearing a lot. I was kind of bitter today. <laughs> I feel what's wrong. Are you alright? You want to go by later? Please stay. Of course. Can I talk about it? Yes. Just not appreciated. No, it knows me. No, it is. Oh, no, whoa, it's me. Everything's horrible. And no, I didn't. <sighs> Matthew, answer the question, Francis. Please just answer it. I'm sorry if the volume's going up and down. Matthew, people care about you whether or not you're invisible. Weather should have a H, just, just saying that. Well, in the British spelling. British English, that would be a H, yeah. You, to a lot of people, look so much like your brother, but to some of us can tell the difference between you and him. If you get to know them. Does that even matter, Fred? Matthew, you have to remember. Arthur, Alfred, and I took the time to get to know you. We got to know Matthew. And you may not think it, but we love you, Matthew. I'm assuming that's you because it's a lie. All the people who forget you are missing out, are missing out on such a great friend. A lot of cut out text. We're always here for you, little brother. Never forget that, we? Bonjour, Matthew. Hey, Francis. What's up? I just wanted to see how you were doing. Well, I'm feeling much better now, Francis. Thanks. Anytime, Matthew. Right. And now we walk very slowly out. Actually, it's not that slow, but... Eh. <laughs> right. 
Romano, lo vino. Where are you at? Where are you at? Can I walk up? No, I can't. Where are you at? Lo vi, lo vi. Lo vi. Heck. Where is he? <laughs> there he is! I'm gonna save it again. Lovino! My brother Francis is here to spread the, to spread the love! <laughs> Don't fucking talk to me, I'm bastard! Lovino? Are you alright? Fan fucking plastic! Just great considering all the shit I've given on a daily basis. I'm given on a daily basis. Do you want to talk about it? Do you want to talk about it? Yes, just not with you. You're the absolute worst person to speak to. Would it make it better if I pulled back my hair and did, and did my best impression of Antonio or Feliciano? That would make everything worse! You know what? Just, just forget it! Come on, Lovi. Big brother cares. I'll listen. Fine. It's just... I feel goddamned invisible sometimes. Grandpa used to only pay attention to Feli when he was born. For me, it was always Lovino, go help Feli with cooking. Or Lovino, your brother's being cute. Come look! Every time it was either with only Feli or both of us. Never one was. Never once, I'm shimming. It was Lovino, how about we spend time together without Feli? I feel like the best way to get through them would probably be to agree with him. Well, that's rude of him. <laughs> I know, right? I fucking love of Grandpa Rome. When Feli was getting love and attention, I got jack shit. I just want to punch something so fucking much right now. Alright, just don't punch me. Too late, mother. <laughs> don't talk shit about Grandpa Rome. <laughs> Only I can do that. Well, then. I know you're a bit of a bitch, but I was just... Lovina... Uh, eh... Uh, let's talk about it. Blech. Fine. Uh, he loved you both. He loved you both very much, Lovi. The hell he did! He never bothered to check in on me, only Feli. Sometimes I wonder if I really exist. Am I just some collective mass hallucination? The world may never fucking know. Why even is there a fucking South Italy? I don't know, goddammit! Movino, you're focusing on the bad parts. They're blinding you to the good ones. Think really hard. Think of your brother. He cares so much about you. And he was so much like Rome. So in turn, Rome loved you too. Okay, if you pull that feelings are inherited too bullshit on me, I will <laughs> throw you over the goddamn fence. You know, Lovi, maybe Rome wasn't trying. You know, Lovi, maybe Rome wasn't was trying to give you some space. Because I know that Rome loved you also. I, I need a little while alone. I need to think. Of course. How are you doing, Lovina? Still feeling like shit, but better than before. Good to know. Listen, I'm not really big on the whole gratitude thing. So just know I... I understand, Lovina. I was happy to help. Don't be so fucking flamboyant. You're ruining the mood. 
can do, Lovey. And for fuck's sake, stop calling me that. Stop calling me that. Nope. <laughs> he said, nope. <laughs> and just runs away laughing. This is that, you know, that anime woman laugh. Like, Sardonic's just, oh! <laughs> that that's that's how he makes his exit. He just flounces out like that. Probably, maybe I don't know. I mean, he can take things seriously, but you know, Prasha, gonna save it. Prasha, hmm. Oh, hello, Franz. I'm just looking through some old bro broken house houses from before the Berlin Wall was taken down. It's just so depressing looking through all this, being reminded of back then. Why though? Why though? Well, I just felt that I needed to, alright? I'm just stopped myself right now. You can leave me be for now. I'll be alright. Alright, Gilbert. I'll give you some space. Why did that give me a game over? Oh shit! Oi! Don't walk away from me, you sassy Sue! Uh, are you alright? Are you alright? Yeah, you can say good. That's sarcasm. Because you just said I'm very good. You don't sound very good, judging by the shaking text box. Your voice went. Your voice box went shaky and everything. <laughs> yeah, he, he's so good. Why do I get the feeling that you're not telling the, the entire truth? Because I'm not. But nothing's really wrong. I just had a bit of an emotional drainage. That's all. <laughs> Prasha, you're never this sad though. Come on, we're best friends. You could tell me. Fine. It's just the fact that I used to be great, you know? Now people don't even have one unit in school about me. You're still great. You're still great? You really think that, Francis? Or are you just saying that? Because we're friends. Yes, I really do believe it. Listen, you don't need to. You don't need a history unit learning about you to prove you're great. Also, learning things in general is fun until you have to do it for a grade. So learning about Prussia would just be better because you wouldn't have to. Yeah. <laughs> I should know. The most they touch on the subject of Ma is my own country. <laughs> At least you have a country still. You think that matters, Gilbert? Whether or not a country or have a unit in history class doesn't determine how great we are. I does if the country It does not it? It does if the country has an ego to uphold. Okay. Now you're just being unreasonable, Gilbert. As is my job to do so. <laughs> so is it safe to say that you're you again? Yeah. Thanks, Francis. It does help to know that someone appreciates my awesomeness. It would be a crime not to, Gilbert. Are you holding up? I'm good. My mood has improved a lot. Thanks, Francis. I owe you one, buddy. <laughs> My friend, <laughs> you owe me nothing, Gilbert. Danke. But what if he like hates owing things and he's like, no, no, I gotta, I gotta. Oh hey, we got color. And no, it's back to Greystale. Right. Um. Hmm. You know, I'll stop it here and we'll continue on in another part. So, have a good day, humans. I will see you all next time. But until then, keep being awesome. <laughs>